Hey guys, I'm City here and welcome back to Minecraft. In this video, we're gonna be playing some Minecraft, but on hardcore mode. I'm gonna be honest, I never thought I'd be doing this, uh, just because, you know, if you die, you lose everything. And because of that, I was pushing it away. I was like, nah, I'm not I'm not really interested in it. But I was watching, uh, I, I'm sure all of you know who Dan TDM is. I was watching him and I saw him lose, you know, everything because he died in his hardcore series. And because of that, I don't know why, but I just wanted to play hardcore mode. I wanted to see what all the hype's about. And uh, yeah, that's why we're going to be playing some Minecraft hardcore mode. If you guys are excited, be sure to drop a like. I'm not sure how many likes this video is going to get, but you know, surprise me, I guess. <laughs> Subscribe if you're new for more Minecraft content in the future. If you guys want this to become a legit series where I actually play Minecraft hardcore, then let me know in the comment section. But without further ado, here is Minecraft Java Edition hardcore mode. <laughs> Here we go. All right, we're gonna go ahead and create our new world. World name is gonna be called... I think this is a perfect name for the world because, you know, if I die, I will regret everything. So, <laughs> you know, we're just gonna go with that. Obviously, switch the game mode to hardcore. I think that's everything. But, you know, I, I'm, I'm definitely not ready for this, guys. I really am not because mobs, like creepers, they one-shot me. Like, I, I am very, very scared right now. All right, we're here. Got a mountain in the background. All right, I think we should kill these sheep just because, you know, we don't want to be awake uh, during nighttime. Because obviously mobs are a lot more powerful in hardcore mode. I'm not sure if I need all of the same color wool. I mean, I'm not really that big of an expert when it comes to Minecraft. Sure, I'm good at building and all that, but I'm not the best when it comes to Minecraft, all right? The goal is to obviously beat the Ender Dragon. If I die after that, I'm not going to be that sad. But... <laughs> Yeah, if I do die in this episode, I will give it another shot, don't worry, uh, in a future episode. But yeah, right now we're just trying to get into the swing of things. I'm not quite sure. Well, I mean, I don't I don't know why we spawned in this biome. I really don't like this biome. There, there's too many trees. But we do have a mount. Oh, okay, yeah, we're not, we're not ready for that. But we got our wool. I mean, I guess I should start breaking some trees because we got to make a crafting table. Got to make a furnace, but first we need a pickaxe. Got, got a lot of stuff to do. I don't know why I'm doing this. I really don't. Get some food. I can't take any risks of just running around with low hunger. All right, I don't see anything off in the distance over there. If I fall down here, I'm dead. <laughs> so let's try to be a little bit cautious of our surroundings. Oh, a black sheep. I actually never see black sheep. That's kind of cool. Uh, I guess I'll just cut back to you guys when I find something actually interesting. All right, so I have been uh, mining a bit. I also got some cooked food, three furnaces, and a bit of coal. Uh, I'm pretty sure... I mean, I'm still on the same mountain, but I did make some progress. So now we have enough food to actually, you know, go out, journey off to who knows where. I'm not sure where I want to make my house, though. I'm, I'm thinking of, like, a, a nice open area with oak trees, because I, I, I feel like oak wood is the most nice-looking wood in the game as well as spruce, those two. I, I know these are spruce, but I just don't, I don't like the biome type. You know, there's too many trees in it. So if we can get an area where there's oak trees and spruce trees, then that, that'd be amazing. Whoa, okay, there's a creeper right there. Is that a ravine? Oh my, it is a ravine. Well, I mean, it's a mini ravine. I, uh, I don't know what to do. Should I, like, investigate it? Who knows what you'll find in these caves, you know what I'm saying? Oh my god, no, 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 no! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Yep, we're not we're not doing that. We're we're definitely not doing that. Holy sh
Oh, no. <laughs> no, I'm good. Yeah, you can have that caveman. Oh, my. Why do you have a... What? Here's a... Bro. Oh, no. I, I, I just saw my... My least favorite mob in the entire game, a skeleton. Wait, 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 what is that? You guys see that over there? Hold up, let me eat my meat. I said, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. Oh shoot, yo, I'm gonna have to do a hard pause on that. I, I, I think I saw a village over here. Oh, I did! Let's go! This is a small village though, like what the heck? I've never seen a village with two houses. Okay, potatoes, some saplings, a feather, another bed. We gotta get the pee bed, boys, you know what I'm saying? Oh, okay, there we go, That, that that's much better. Dang, that's a big house. Hold up. Give me that. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. All right, we got some bells. Got to grab those, you know, because uh, of raids in the future, if I ever, you know, make it to that point. All right, there we go. Got our bread. And then the last house of the village, nothing. Cool. You know, I'm going to be honest. That was a really small house. Oh, seeds. What do you got, sir? Uh, wow. Okay, cool. So, and a, a whole emerald for bread you know what guys i think i found the spot this mountain right here i like the way it looks we can probably hollow out the mountain uh put a house on top i really see this working out in our favor you know sometimes you just got to use your natural uh resources you know like this is already a foundation put in place for us this is great. Yep, this is where I'm gonna. This is where I'm gonna make home. And we got a village in front of us. If I, if I ever want to make a villager farm, we got that. What is this? Oh, blast furnace. Oh, wait. How do you even make a blast furnace, dude? That's freaking fast, my guy. That's awesome. Okay, we're gonna do. What we're gonna do is make some armor, and we're gonna make a iron pick. We'll make a chest. Store all of our stuff on top of the mountain for now. You know, all the junk. All right, we got ourselves 48 bread from that. That's kind of crazy. But I'm very happy with the location I picked. Uh, I really do see a lot of potential with this mountain. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. All right, it's daytime. The sun's looking beautiful as always. We could make ourselves a axe. And now we can start mining these trees away. All right, so we're back. One thing that you probably can tell is that I've been trying to shape the mountain to look more of a artificial look rather than a natural look because the natural look of it wasn't that nice. And I really want to give it that like that homey feel. So 
I think it looks sick right now. Obviously, we're gonna make a lot of changes, but I, you know, I, I came across some gravel and I needed some iron to make a new shovel. But while I was out looking for some iron, I did find something, and that something is, uh, it's giving me some PTSD. I, uh, I found a mine shaft, and we all know, we all know how much I love mine shafts, guys, right? <laughs> right? They're worse than creepers. Where'd you come from? This happy music playing in the background, and I'm freaking struggling to survive oh, here. Oh, God! A creeper? Bro! Oh! I could try and retrace my steps. Or not! It's so doo-doo. And I'm about to die to lava. Let's go! Let's go! But yeah, the mine shaft is somewhere over there in a cave. I saw a skeleton. I was like, hell no, I'm leaving. So I'd left, but I did manage to get some iron. We'll probably go back to that mine shaft in another episode, but I'm 100% not going there now. But yeah, we're gonna get this iron, make our shovel, and probably finish up some more landscaping. Yeah, this does much better. I was I was really about to dig through all of this using my fist. Hell no. Guys, we have a problem. I was, uh, you know, doing some landscaping. I went inside to check and see how the house is. And I was greeted to two creepers and two spiders and two endermen. So I don't know what to do. <laughs> because if I hit these guys and they start attacking me, I am, I I'm dead. Like, it's a game over. So I'm not sure what to do. I'm good. I mean, I'm doing good with the landscaping. It's just that, you know, I got two endermen in my house. Uh, I'm trying to make it symmetrical. It's looking good as of right now. I'm not sure guys, I, I really am not sure what to do, um, I guess maybe they'll go away while I'm offline, but we're gonna end the video here, if you guys did enjoy, be sure to drop a like on the video, that would be greatly appreciated, that, that's how I'll know if you guys want me to make this into a series, uh, if you guys are new, why not subscribe, this hardcore series is definitely gonna get juicy, but I'm not sure if these guys can tell if I'm looking at them through the door, I'm gonna make sure I don't look at them at all, uh, it is becoming nighttime, so I do have to make this outro quick, uh, comment down some tips, that would be greatly appreciated as well, and, um, I guess I'll see you in the next one, and as always, ah!